Saltwater intrusion from the Gulf of Mexico is already causing problems in Lower Plaquemines Parish and St. Bernard Parish could be next. WGNO's Rick Gogrieb looks at what is being done to stop it. The drought that is affecting much of the country is causing a low flow in the Mississippi River. Due to this, salt water from the Gulf is making its way up the river. The Corps of Engineers already has one sill in place to try to block the salt water, but it's not getting the job done. The river channel here is below sea level, so when the flows in the Mississippi River drop, seawater, which is denser than freshwater salt water, moves upstream at the bottom of the river. And so we're seeing extreme low flows. And so we're seeing an excessive saltwater uh, intrusion. The estimate is the saltwater could reach the intakes for St. Bernard's water supply system by October 8th, which will lead to problems like damaged pipes and contaminated water in the system. We know we have to maintain about 9 million gallons a day here in St. Bernard Parish to um, make sure that our citizens can, can continue to live in a normal way. Can we provide that um, with totally fresh water, that remains to be seen. To combat the wedge, Parish President Guy McGinnis is working with several organizations, including the Corps of Engineers and the Governor's Office of Homeland Security and Emergency Preparedness, focusing on several strategies. Reverse osmosis, trying to uh, get the units here so that we can take the salt out of the water w when we get it from the river. Barging, which the Corps is going to be helping, delivering water from upriver. We have to build a reservoir and a pump to get it into our system. We've worked with the city and Jackson Barracks to connect to the city. If the salt water makes its way farther up the river, it could affect other parishes' water supplies. The whole uh, New Orleans regional area can be affected by this, so we, you know, we're working our hardest to get, get, a, get a solution. And Rick tells us that St. Bernard Parish leaders have asked local grocery stores to stock up on water due to the potential hazard and will also be handing out water themselves to residents as well. For more information when it will be announced or when or where the water distribution will be, uh, tune in to WGNO.com.